Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we have got these uh, three triangles, uh, this uh, blue triangle, uh, the green triangle, and this uh, white uh, triangle, fully inscribed uh, in a rectangle uh, A, B, C, D, as you can see in this given diagram, such that the area of this uh, blue shaded uh, triangle is uh, 60 centimeter square, and this uh, side length uh, of this uh, blue triangle uh, is uh, 10 centimeter whereas uh, this uh, side length uh, a e equal to this side length uh, a b and now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded uh, triangle uh, a d e please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100 percent true to the scale let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step let's focus on this blue shaded triangle uh, a B E and we can see that this is an isosceles triangle since uh, this side length uh, equal to this side length and in this uh, next step I have dropped this perpendicular A F uh, on this uh, side uh, E B and as a result we are ended up with these uh, two right triangles uh, this uh, triangle uh, A F uh, E and this uh, triangle uh, A F B and now we can see that these are two right triangles, uh, triangle uh, AFB and the other triangle uh, AFE are our congruent uh, triangles. So therefore we conclude uh, that this uh, segment uh, EF is going to be equal to this segment uh, BF. In other words, uh, these segments uh, have equal length. If this uh, whole uh, side length uh, EB is uh, 10 units, then this uh, segment uh, EF is going to be 5 and the other segment uh, FB is going to be 5 as well. And I'm going to label uh, this perpendicular AF uh, as our height uh, lowercase uh, h. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half times base uh, times the height. Now let's focus once again on this uh, blue triangle. Its uh, base uh, is uh, this uh, 10 centimeter. The height uh, is uh, lowercase uh, h and the area has been given to us as uh, 60. Let's fill in the blanks in this formula. So we got uh, 60 equals to a half uh, times our base uh, is uh, 10 times our height uh, is lowercase uh, h. If we simplify, we are going to get uh, 60 equals to 5 uh, times uh, h. Let's divide both sides by 5 to isolate h. This 5 and 5 is gone. So therefore, our height h turns out to be 12 centimeter. And now we can see our height h is this AF segment length. So therefore, this AF length is going to be 12 centimeter. And now let's focus on this right triangle AEF whose uh, side lengths are uh, 12, 5, and this side uh, is uh, unknown. And now let's recall the Pythagorean triplets, 5, 12, and 13. And in our case, uh, we got the side lengths uh, 12 and uh, 5. So therefore, uh, this uh, unknown side length uh, is going to be 13 centimeter. You may use the Pythagorean theorem as well to calculate uh, this uh, unknown uh, side length. And now let's make an observation. We can see this uh, side length uh, AE equal to this side length uh, AB. If this side length is 13, then this uh, AB length is going to be 13 centimeter as well. And in this uh, next step, I have dropped this uh, perpendicular EP on this uh, side AB as you can see. And now let's recall the area of triangle formula once again. Area equals to a half times base times the height. Now let's focus once again on this uh, blue triangle. Its base uh, is uh, 13 centimeter. Its uh, height uh, is uh, AP. And the area of this blue triangle has been given to us as 60 centimeter square. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, triangle area formula. So we got uh, 60 equals to a half times uh, 13 times our height. Uh, is uh, EP. So let's simplify. So we got 60 equals to 13 divided by 2 
times the uh, e p length and now i'm going to multiply both sides uh, by 2 divided by 13 on this side and over here 2 divided by 13 on this side uh, as well to isolate uh, e p and here we can see 13 and 13 is gone 2 and 2 is gone so therefore our height uh, e p length uh, turns out to be 120 divided by 13 centimeter so thus our this uh, ep length turns out to be 120 divided by 13 now let's make an observation we can see that this uh, ep length uh, equal to this uh, ad side length if this side length uh, is uh, 120 divided by 13 then this uh, ad length uh, has got to be 120 divided by 13 centimeter as well and here's our next step let's focus on this uh, green shaded triangle uh, ade we can see this is our 90 degree angle since we are dealing with these uh, rectangle let's assume this uh, segment uh, de is uh, x centimeter and now our task is uh, to find the value of this uh, x so therefore we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem on this triangle and here's our Pythagorean theorem a square plus b square equal to c square and in our case uh, our hypotenuse is 13 and our two other legs are 120 divided by 13 and uh, x so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula so we got uh, x square plus uh, 120 divided by 13 whole uh, square equals to 13 square let's simplify that is going to give us uh, x square plus uh, 144 with two zeros divided by 169 equals to 169 on the right hand side and now i'm going to move this uh, fraction to the other side so therefore we are going to have uh, x square equals to 169 minus uh, 14400 divided by 169 and now in this uh, next step i have tweaked this 169 and that could be written as uh, 28561 divided by 169 and this way now we have the common denominator as 169 so therefore we can write uh, x square equals to 28561 minus 14400 divided by the common denominator 169 and now let's simplify furthermore uh, x square equal to 14161 divided by 169 and now we are going to undo the square by taking square root uh, on both uh, sides and here we can see that our uh, x value turns out to be 119 divided by 13 so thus our x value turns out to be 119 divided by 13 and here's our final step let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, green shaded triangle ade and now let's recall once again the area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times uh, base uh, times the height and in our case uh, the base of this green triangle uh, is uh, 119 divided by 13 and the height of this uh, triangle is uh, 120 divided by 13 so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this formula so we got a half uh, times our base is uh, 119 divided by 13 times the height is uh, 120 divided by 13 and if we simplify everything on the right hand side that is going to give us uh, 7140 divided by 169 centimeter square so thus after all the calculations and manipulations the area of this uh, green shaded triangle turns out to be 7140 divided by 169 centimeter square and that is going to be approximately equal to 42.25 centimeter square as well and that's our final answer Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.